let's consider 4x plus 5y equals 7 which is equation 1 and we consider 3x plus 2y equals 9 which is equation 2 whenever you begin to consider the coefficient of x or the coefficient of y that means you want to apply elimination method however in this video we want to consider only substitution method that means i will choose either equation one or equation two to make x or y the subject let me choose equation two and make x the subject that is from equation two here we have 3x plus 2y is 9. I will now have that 3x is 9 plus 2y will move and become minus 2y. We want to make x the subject. Hence, I will leave x on this side. On the other side, we have 9 minus 2y. 3 will move. On the other side, it will divide because it's multiplying x and this becomes our equation 3 next i will substitute equation 3 into equation 1 in equation 1 we have 4x plus 5y is 7 i will have 4x as a value plus 5y is 7 the value for x is 9 minus 2y divide by 3 this is like over 1 next 4 will multiply 9 and you have 36 next 4 will multiply minus 2y you have minus 8y 1 will multiply 3 and you're going to have 3 here you have plus 5y is 7 this is like over one next we're going to consider the lowest common multiple i will draw a line on the other side is seven what can go into three and one without you generating a decimal number which is the lowest number it is three three divided by three is one one multiply everything at this top it will return 36 minus 8y will return plus 3 divided by 1 is 3 3 times 5 is 15 and there we have y next 3 will multiply 7 on the other side and you have 21 21 on this side you have 36 minus 8y plus 15y you're going to have plus 7 y our aim is to make y the subject hence we're going to have 7y is 21 minus 36 7y is minus 15 and y is minus 15 over 7 now we have obtained the value for y next from equation 3 x is 9 minus 2y divide by 3 we are going to substitute y equals minus 15 over 7 into equation 3 and you are going to have that x is 31 over 7 next we're going to test for accuracy by substituting x equals 31 over 7 and y equals minus 15 over 7 into equation 1 and equation 2 if you solve correctly you are going to get 7 for equation 1 and for equation 2 you are going to get 9 we have x to be 31 over 7 how did we obtain this x is 9 minus 2y divide by 3 x is 9 minus 2y has a value hence we are going to substitute which is minus 15 over 7 x is now 9 minus times minus is plus 2 
multiply 15 is 30 and we are going to have over 7. At the denominator, we have 3. Next, we are going to have that x is this is like over 1. 7 multiply by 9 will give you 63. 1 multiply by 30 will give you 30. Everything divide by 7. At the denominator, you have 3. Next, x is 63 plus 30 will give you 93. Divide by 7. At the denominator, you have 3. x is 93. Divide 7 times 3. 7 will come down. It's at the denominator of 93. To multiply whatsoever is at the denominator. 3 here is 1. And 3 here is 31. x is 31 over 7. x is 31 over 7. And we have that y is minus 15 over 7. To test for accuracy from equation 1, we have 4x plus 5y. The value for x is 31 over 7, while the value for y is minus 15. At the denominator, we have 7, and this is 7. For equation 2, the coefficient of x is 3, and the coefficient of y is 2. And here we have 9. If this video was helpful, please hit the like button. Subscribe for more videos like this. I will see you in the next video lesson.